On this video today, I wanna to show you one of the easiest ways on how to make money on YouTube without making the videos yourself and earning anything up to $20,000 a month. And some of these channels are earning even more. The amazing part about this niche is that you can get a lot of views very quickly in just a short period of time. But this also applies to small channels. This channel over here has less than 6,000 subscribers, 5,300 subscribers, got 180,000 views just in the last month. And this is happening over and over again. This channel over here has under 5,000 subscribers and just in the last month has had over 240,000 views. And the best part about this niche is that you don't need to even use your own voice if you don't want to. You never need to show your face and you don't even need to use a camera. And I'm gonna show you a free software that you can get started with today to create these videos and to make money on YouTube. Let's get into it. And the niche that we're gonna be looking at today is in quotes. These channels and these videos, as you can see, get a lot of views because people absolutely love watching and reading these different types of quotes. And there's a lot of channels, smaller channels, that have recently started that have proven that you can very easily start up a channel in the quotes niche, get your subscribers, get your watch hours, and if you do things properly, get your channel monetized and make some really good money on YouTube in this particular niche. I'm gonna show you exactly how you can do it with the free software and where you can get these different types of quotes. Here is one channel over here that's doing this called Wisdom of Ages. They've got 159,000 subscribers. And when you can see, they only post a couple of videos every single, well, every single month or so. So two videos a month over here, then two months ago, a couple of videos, and three months ago, a couple of videos, etc. And you can see that their videos are getting tens of thousands of views. If you go to sort by and take a look at most popular, you can see here that eight months ago, nine months ago, six months ago, they've got videos that have had millions of views. These are evergreen views, and these are different types of quotes about wisdom, about relationships that people absolutely love reading and watching. And some of these quotes are by famous people, different types of backgrounds, etc., different types of religions. So they have a lot of meaning to people. And these different thumbnails are very, very easy to create. And when you click onto one of these videos to see how these videos are created, you can see here that what they have is they'll have writing coming over the top. And as you move the scenes over, this writing will change. They've got a voiceover, which I'm gonna show you where you can get very easily. And they've basically got a still image. And then they also have some audio in the background, which I'm also going to show you where you can get. So let me play this very quickly for you. To reach great heights and our comfort when we falter. So you can see that the video creation is not that difficult at all. And like I said to you, at the start of the video, no one is showing the face. You can potentially get somebody else to do the voiceover for you and you don't even need to have a camera. All you need is very basic video editing skills and a software to be able to create this for you. And I'm gonna show you where you can get that. Here is another channel over here called Red Frost Motivation. They've got 1.69 million subscribers, very similar to the first channel. As you can see, these thumbnails are very, very simple to create. This channel creates content on a much regular basis by the looks of things. Four days ago, you can see 12,000 views and a couple of months ago, 53,000 views, then 214,000 views, 74,000 views, etc. And when you take a look at their most popular videos, you can see that a couple of years ago, uh, they've created a video, they got almost 10 million views. And when we take a look at this channel on Social Blade over here, you can see that this channel is making anything up to $16,000 a month. Not bad for a channel, that's posting one video every couple of months. But when you look at these videos, and you can see here these channels, sorry, that the maximum CPM for this is up to $4. Some of these channels can have a much higher CPM as well. Another channel I wanted to show you if he's literally called Quotes, 571,000 subscribers. And you can see that some of these are also running streams. There's 24 people watching this one. And then you can see three weeks ago, 107,000. One month ago, 668,000. So these videos are getting a lot of views. And you can see he just 11 months ago, 5.5 million views, etc. So a lot of videos are very evergreen and they're making these people a lot of money on YouTube. Another quick channel that I wanted to show you is this one over here called Daily Motivation. 
motivation. You can see here when we look at these videos and you look at most popular as well, they're getting 6 million views, 6 million views, 4 million views, so getting a lot of views. And when you take a look at this channel and you go to date added newest, you can see that they're posting three days ago, five days ago, 10 days ago, and you can see that they're getting hundreds of thousands of views very, very quickly. And this channel as well is making anything up to $20,000 every single month. But I would assume that this channel, based on the amount of views that they're getting, are more than likely making a lot more money. So I wanted to show you the different types of channels that are out there. Also, I wanted to show you at the start of this video that you can actually do this even with a small channel and still get hundreds of thousands of views. And I'll show you how people are ranking these videos as well. So what we need to do from here before we continue is we need to smash that like button in appreciation if you enjoy my content. And also don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you want to learn how to start a YouTube channel, how to grow a YouTube channel, learn about different niches and what you can do as a beginner to make it on YouTube, then make sure you subscribe with the bell on so you get notified every time I post one of these brand new videos that's gonna help you make it on YouTube. Now what we need to do is we need to find some video editing software that you can use because we're gonna build everything from there. There's two different platforms that you can use that are super simple to get started with this. The first one that you can use is this one over here called canva.com, which is the one I'm gonna to use to show you on this video. And another awesome software that you can use is this one over here called invideo.io. I've spoken about Nvidia a number of times, but I wanna show you how to do this with a different software today. But any one of these softwares will work really, really well. Nvidia is more AI generated, which will create the videos probably a little bit quicker for you. But I wanna show you how to use Canva because that's also simple as well. And both of those are linked in the description of this video. You can sign up absolutely for free. So what you wanna do when you're on Canva, is just quite simply come over here and click on to videos. Once you click on to videos, you're gonna see that you're gonna have all these different options. And basically what you wanna do is you wanna use this, which is the 1920 by 1080. You wanna click onto that, and this is going to open up a blank canvas for yourself. What you now need to do is you need to work out the type of video that you want to create. So let's say for example, we saw this video over here, we can see that it has done well, it's got a lot of views, and this is about you know wise quotes about family, um, you can do something about relationships, you can do something about marriage, just as an example. So if you were gonna create a video like that, what you will do is you'd come back over to Canva, and you can see here that you've got this element section, and under elements, what you can do is you can just type in something like couple, as an example, just like you saw in that other video. And once you do that is you've got you know, you can take, leave this on all, go to graphics, photos, videos, and audio. And the two that I'll be more than likely using is photos and videos. So if you go to videos, you're gonna find all these different videos on couples, okay? So what you wanna do is you wanna scroll down and potentially find maybe a video like this or like that, maybe one that's about 22 seconds long and something where you have a lot of room to put some text over. So let's just click onto this. This is going to bring this over to you. So we're going to stretch this out, okay? We're gonna cover this entire scene. Okay, so that's all you do there. Then from here, you can see if you wanted to add more scenes, you're going to be able to add a page and that can be a photo, that can be a video, etc. The other thing that you can also do with this scene is that if you don't want it to be 22 seconds long, you could lower this, you can make this scene a lot shorter, okay? And maybe do say a scene for about, say 12 seconds long, okay? And just leave that there. And as you can see, that's gonna go through to there. Now what we need to do is we need to start adding some content to this particular scene, okay? So what we have at the moment is we have this scene where it zooms out, okay? And we know that this is about relationships, etc. So what you quite simply wanna do is just come over to Google like this and just type in wise quotes about marriage and love. This is one place where you can get a lot of these quotes. The other place where you can get a lot of these quotes is all these different channels that I just showed you, okay? And when you're on one of these channels or one of these videos, if you scroll down over here, you're gonna see these three little dots. If you click onto these three little dots and you go to show transcript, what this is going to do is it's going to show you this entire transcript of this video. And these are all quotes. These quotes aren't owned by this channel. They're just reusing these quotes. And then what you can do is see these three little dots. What you're normally gonna see is these timestamps. All you need to do is click onto these three little dots, click onto toggle timestamps, and it's going to remove those. Then all you need to do is just you know hold this, copy, and then you can use a lot of these different types of quotes. So this is where you can also get a lot of these quotes. 
but generally you can also very easily come over to Google and just type in, you know, wise quotes about marriage, love, etc. You can see that there's going to be hundreds of these different websites with tons of different types of quotes that you can very easily put videos together. So I'm going to do two just to show you how this is going to work. So let me just grab this first quote over here. So I'm going to grab this one. We're going to copy this. We're going to come straight over to Canva. And then what you want to do is you want to come here on the left hand side and you want to click onto text. Once you click onto text, you just want to use a very simple text that stands out. Okay. So nothing too, you know, complicated, nothing that's too shiny or anything like that. Just something nice, plain and simple that stands out. So let's just say we want to use this one over here. I'm going to click onto that, drag this out, double click onto that bottom, delete that. Okay. Then all we need to do is double click onto that and just paste this quote in here. And then what you want to do is you want to drag this out. Okay. Just like that. And then all we need to do is push this up. Now with this particular quote over here, what you can do is you can come up and you can change the color. Okay. Of that. So you can change that to a different color. The other thing that you can do is click onto effects. So you've got all these different effects. Okay. That you can play around with. Like if you chose this one, you can give it a black background like that. And then what you can do is you can offset it. Okay. You can also increase this transparency just to make it stand out a little bit. Okay. So as you can see, that's easier on the eyes to see now. The next thing that you can do is you can animate this as well. So as you can see, if you do rise, pan, fade, pop. And so you want it to be something just simple for people to see, like something like this breathe looks really, really good. Or even if you use something where it just kind of types in, if there's enough time in that scene. So maybe use something like breathe as an example, you can also do in, or you can do out. Okay. So you can choose exactly what you want and you can also select the scale. So let's just do in. It's going to look very interesting because when we play this now, what you're going to see is this scene's going in, this scene's going out. So if you hit play now, let's just see what this is going to look like. So you can see how this draws attention to this particular scene. And you can imagine that this is going to look really good once we add some music to this and once we add a voiceover to this. So that's the first scene that we've got. So you can close this. Now what you want to do is you want to add a second scene. So you click onto this. Now you just come back straight over to elements over here. Now we can go to photos. Okay. And what we can do is we can maybe grab um, another really cool scene. So let's just grab this one over here. You can stretch this out. Okay. Again, remember I'm using scenes where I've got a lot of room. Maybe this one here isn't the best one, but you see exactly what I mean by what I'm using. Actually, let's use this one over here. This one looks a little bit better. So we can just delete that and let's stretch this out. Okay. This one looks a little bit better than the other one and you can see a lot better. So just put that there. Okay. So we can leave that. Now all you need to do again is go straight back over to Google guys and then just grab a second quote. So let's grab this, copy that, come straight back over to Canva. Again, you just want to go to text, pretty much try and use the same text, delete that, copy that, hit control V and then just stretch this out. Now, if you wanted to use all the same effects and everything that you're using guys, okay, so you can put that there. Okay. Maybe get rid of that point. So if you wanted to use something where you didn't have to redo everything, so let's just delete this. I'll show you what you could do. You could come back over to here. Okay. You could copy this element. So just click onto that, go right mouse, click and copy. Then you can just come over to this scene. Okay. And paste this in here. All right. And then all you need to do is grab that and we're going to come straight back over to here. Double click onto this and hit control V. Okay. And we're going to get rid of this point. Okay. And then you can maybe choose this and just center it like this and maybe stretch it out a little bit more. You can move it over to the sides completely up to you. So now we have two scenes over here. Now what we can do is if we were to play this. Okay. So if we hit play, you're going to see that's moving there. Then it's going to go to here and that's going to move as well. And if you wanted to make this video a lot longer, you would just keep grabbing more and more of these different quotes and adding more of these scenes. Now, if you wanted to go and find different scenes, like if you came over here to elements on Canva and you had a look at all these different scenes and you wanted to find other scenes, okay, you could very easily come over to this site over here called pexels.com. You can type in couples or depending on the type of, you know, quote video that you're creating, you can search for whatever you want. They've got videos and photos that you can use that are royalty free. And as you can see, there are a lot of different types of images and videos that you can use absolutely for free. So I just wanted to show you this because this is an option that you have for yourself. So coming back to the video now, 
there's a few things that we need to add to this video. Number one is we need to add some audio in the background. It's going to make it sound a lot nicer. Then I'm going to show you where you can go to get a voiceover and how you can potentially rank these videos as well. Then at the end of the video, I'm going to show you how you can really grow your channel quickly with my help. So what you want to do from here, if you wanted to add some audio, is quite simply come over to your audio library on YouTube. When you create a YouTube channel and you go over to your YouTube studio, on the left hand side of here, when you scroll down, you're going to see this audio library. So there, from there, what you want to do, if you scroll up to the top here, is you've got this search section over here. So once you click onto that, there's a few different things that you can search for, like track title, genre, mood, etc. So let's just say you wanted to search for something like mood as an example. You can scroll down and you can see you've got angry, bright, calm, dark, dramatic, etc. So let's say you wanted to click onto calm as an example and you click onto apply, you're going to hear different types of music that's going to really suit this type of video. So if you come over here, let's just play seasons over here. So you could use something like that, maybe campfire. Uh, maybe you can play something like Cosmetic Drift. Now, if you're not finding something that you like, you can very easily close this off, come straight back up to the top over here, and then you can go and maybe search for something like Genre and then maybe choose one of these. Like, let's go with Ambient. I'm sure that's going to have some really good um, music as well. And then all you need to do is click onto any one of these. So if we play this one, so you can automatically see that this one probably is a little bit more appealing for what we're looking to do. So all you need to do is pause this, go over to the right hand side of here and then click on to download. What this is going to do is it's going to download this onto my computer. Okay. So once this downloads, what we then do is we come straight over to Canva over here. And then what we want to do is we want to go to uploads. You want to click on to uploads and upload this, but you can also grab this drag and drop it over the top. And as you can see, this is now downloading this audio. Okay. For this particular video, once this downloads, I'll show you exactly what this is going to sound like. So now that this has downloaded, all you need to do is click onto it. And once you click onto it, you're going to be able to see that it's there. Now it's going to stop here where the scene stops. Okay. If you wanted to drag it out when you obviously put more scenes on, you absolutely can. So what I'm going to do is just play this so you can see hear exactly what this is going to sound like now. And you can automatically see that it's starting to sound and look a lot better. Now you can click onto this, okay, and you can go to audio effects. You can go to volume as well and just lower this volume once you add the voiceover so it doesn't overpower that. And we're going to see exactly what this is going to look like now. So now what we need to do is we need to add a voiceover to this. There's a couple of places that you can go to get a voiceover. Number one, is yourself. You can very easily record your own voiceover for these two videos, for these two scenes as an example, and just put it on there as well. If you don't want to use your own voice, then what you can do is if you wanted to, if you can afford to pay for it, you can very easily come over to platforms like Fiverr and you can pay someone to create these voiceovers for you. When you scroll down, all you need to do is type in voiceover as an example over here. And then as you scroll down, you're going to find all these different people over here that can do a voiceover for you. Some of them are quite expensive, but you can find some that are relatively cheap. And as you can see, have really good reviews. Over 1,000 people have reviewed this particular person. He's got a five-star rating and he will do a voiceover for you for $15, okay? So it's entirely up to you. You can test this out. There are people over here that will do it for less than that. As you can see, it's $8. So you just want to come over here and test this out. If you don't want to continuously pay for these different types of voiceovers, then you can very easily use platforms like this one over here called speechalo.com. I recently created a video, which I'm going to show you at the end of this video, where I did a whole range of different types of AI software for voiceovers. So feel free to check that out and I'll let you know where to where you can watch that video with a whole heap of different types of voiceovers and video editing software as well. But Speechalo is really good. And the really good thing about Speechalo is that you only need to pay for this particular software once and then you've got it for the life of you having this. Okay. So it's for value, it's probably the best. It just doesn't have a free version to start off with, but I'm going to play this for a few seconds so you can hear exactly what this voiceover sounds like. I'm going to show you how to create this very, very quickly. So let me play this for you. Today, we're going to show you the AI technology that is able to transform any text into speech and read it in such a natural sounding way that it's tough to tell it was just.
So you can see that this is one of the AI voices and I'm going to show you exactly how you can use it. So if we come back over to this scene, let's just do this first one over here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this scene over here. So we're going to copy this. OK, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over to my back office of Speechalo over here. So this is Speechalo itself. This is what the software looks like. And the person that you're just listening to then is this person over here. This is the voiceover Billy and this is one of their you know, top choices. So if I play this. Hi. I'm Billy. I am a native English speaker. So I'm going to pause that. And what we're going to do now is we're going to come over here. We're going to paste that text in here. So as you can see, a successful marriage requires falling in love many times, always with the same person. And this is this exact same text over here. I just want to make sure that's that. So a successful person requires falling in love many times, always with the same person. Okay, so we've got that there. So now what you want to do is come back over to speech over here. And what you want to do is you want to preview this voiceover. So as you can see, you can click over here to preview this. So let's click onto this. A successful marriage requires falling in love many times, always with the same person. Okay, so I'm going to pause that. We're going to close this. Now, you can see here on the right hand side that you've got AI voice, standard voice. You can play around with this. You've got serious tone, friendly tone, normal tone. So if we click onto friendly tone and play this now. A successful marriage requires falling in love many times, always with the same person. So it does sound a little bit better. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to click on to generate this voice. Okay, so we're going to click on to that. And now this is generating. So once that has done, you're going to go go to OK. Now what you want to do is quite simply come over here and click on to download. So we're going to download this. So click on to download. I'm going to no, we don't need to add any background music. OK, and that's been downloaded now. Now what we need to do is we're going to come straight back over to Canva over here. And now what we're going to do is we're going to move this over to the front. OK, and we're going to click onto this and we're going to drop this in here. And as you can see, that's now downloading as well. And now once that finishes downloading, we're going to click onto it. And as you can see, this scene has also been added. Now you can move this over if you don't want it to play straight away. OK, but again, you can click onto this. You can adjust the audio. You can click onto the volume and we're going to use 100 percent. So now what we're going to do is we're going to play this so we can see exactly what this is going to sound like just this first section over here. Now what you can what you need to decide is how long do you really need this scene to be because the voiceover is going to stop here. OK, do you need this entire section? So you could probably very easily minimize this to about here. OK, and then you will need to create more scenes. So let me just show you what this is going to sound like. Let me play this for you. A successful marriage requires falling in love many times, always with the same person. And then it's going to move over to the second scene. And again, what you do from here is you would repeat that same process. So if we close this, we've already got that music there. Now what we need to do is quite simply come over to the second scene, double click onto this. So we're going to copy this section over here. OK, so grab that, copy this, come straight back over to speech low over here. We're going to remove this. We're going to paste that in there. We're going to generate this voice. You can see how simple this is, guys. Go to OK. Then what you want to do, you can see that's done out there. Click on to download. We are not going to use any music from here. We've got our music. Then quite simply come back over to Canva. And now what we want to do is we want to download the second scene. So you just want to make sure that you put this over here at the start of this. OK, then you want to grab that, drop that in there. There's a second file that's downloading. OK. Then you just want to click onto it and it's going to put that there and it's going to it will color code everything for you. So you just move this over to there. So now if we play this scene from here, let's hit play. A successful marriage requires falling in love many times, always with the same person. A great marriage is not when the perfect couple comes together. OK, and then you will just continue to repeat this process from here. What you'll do once your video is finished, Quite simply, you just want to come up to the top, click on to share. You would go to download and you would download this as an MP4 video. And then what you'll do is obviously upload this onto YouTube. Now, once you upload this onto YouTube, what you want to do is when you take a look at these videos is you want to have a look at, you know, what are they using inside their titles in order to get clicks and views and what types of, you know, keywords are they using? And a really good software for that is this one over here called vidiq.com. When you take a look at this video, I've got this extension over here, which shows me exactly, you know, if they are using any tags, this is where the video tags would be. 
but it also shows me the video performance as well. This is a really good tool to have. And when you take a look at vidIQ, if you were to sign up to vidIQ, you can get this extension absolutely for free. I will have a link in the description for you. But on top of that, what it's also gonna allow you to do, if you sign up to vidIQ, what you can very easily do is you can take a look and see what types of quotes people are searching for. So if you type in quotes as an example, and you hit enter, you can come over here and you can see that live quotes, just live quotes as an example, is searched over 58,000 times every single month on YouTube. Inspirational quotes, 73,000 times. You can see quotes channel, people are searching for quotes channels over 125,000 times every single month. Again, quotes about life. So you can see that live quotes, quotes about life is an extremely popular keyword. So if we click onto this as an example, and then go to matching terms, you can see your motivational quotes about life, 95,000 times quotes about life, best quotes, life, 55,000 times. And you can see here, these are all different video titles where you can come over here to create videos about motivational quotes and life. So this is why this tool is super powerful. It can literally show you what people are searching for. And this is a tool that I use religiously every time I go to create a video on YouTube because I wanna know what people are searching for on YouTube. So it's really important to do your SEO and to know exactly what you are going to create your next video about or your current video about and find something that is being searched a lot on YouTube. Now, how would you double down with this to make even more money on YouTube? Well, one way that I found that a lot of these channels are doing this is they're creating merch, okay? They're going out there and creating different types of merch and they're using sites like this one over here called teespring.com. If you scroll down, you can very easily take a look and see what other people are creating. They're creating stores and they're linking it in the description of their videos because people that are watching these types of videos would probably like to have these different types of affirmation t-shirts, etc., mugs, phone cases, a whole heap of different types of apparel that you can very easily create like stickers and hats as well. And another cool site that you can do this on is called redbubble.com. You can very easily come over here and create a store. I've created stores on Redbubble myself as well and promoted it through affiliate marketing. It works really, really well. It's just an added way that you can make money with affiliate marketing promoting these different types of t-shirts using print on demand. And you can see here, if you type in t-shirts and go to motivational, I mean, these shirts are selling for $29, $28, $27, and you could be making three to $5 on a t-shirt just for placing a link in the description of your video. And you saw that some of these videos are getting millions of views and you can very easily take inspiration and create very, very similar types of videos. Now, when it comes to creating these videos, when it comes to growing your YouTube channel, I know it isn't easy. I did it the hard way, I didn't have a lot of help, and I did a lot of research. So I've been on YouTube now for four years and I've got a lot of tips and tricks and hints that can help you get started on YouTube, do your SEO, create your videos, find a niche, go viral, etc. which is why myself and Greg, another YouTuber, but he's got a channel called Caffeinated Blogger, have created this course. It is a unbelievable course, which is going to show you exactly what we did to start making well over $20,000 a month. And the way we have priced it is to be fair to you so you don't have to pay an arm and a leg and a crazy amount of money to get the wealth of knowledge that we are offering you in this course. The link is in the description of this video. We will literally give you an evergreen views formula. This is what we do every single day to make tens of thousands of dollars every single month with YouTube ad revenue and everything else that comes on the back of that. So there's so many different ways that you can make money on YouTube and we are going to reveal that in this course for you. So if you want to start a YouTube channel, if you want to grow your current YouTube channel, if you want to know how to get more subscribers, if you want to know how to get more views, if you want to know everything about YouTube that there is, it's going to be in this course and we are going to help you every step of the way. So all you need to do is click onto that link in the description of this video. What you are going to find is that there are 10 modules with over 40 videos, which is going to explain everything that you need to do step by step, whether you are a beginner, intermediate, potentially even advanced. If you just wanna see what we're doing to continue growing our YouTube channels, everything is going to be in this course, but it doesn't stop there guys. Quite simply, once you become 
a member of Jet Video Academy, you can join our Facebook group, our private Facebook group. We've got over 421 members. As you can see, we are replying to comments every single day and helping our students achieve the success that they need. We'll do whatever we can to help you as much as we can grow your YouTube channels and get you monetized, get you earning money on YouTube, potentially leaving your nine to five just like we have. So all you need to do is click onto that link in the description of this video and we are more than happy to help you if you decide to take our help with Jet Video Academy. Now, like I said in the video, guys, I wanted to show you another video where you can get to find a whole heap of different types of voiceovers and other software that you can use to create videos like this and you'll find that on this video over here right now. So if you want to know other software that you can use, click onto this video right now. I'll see you on the video. Until next time, you guys take care of yourselves and goodbye.